Hi, I'm Matt Naworski of CPI, and thank you very much for taking the time to watch this video. I'm truly excited to get the opportunity to introduce you to CPI's MultiPrep 7000 Solid Phase Extraction Manifold. I'm also going to talk today a little bit about CPI Solid Phase Extraction Discs, and one of our applications chemists will perform an extraction using our discs and our manifolds. He'll review some basic principles of solid phase extraction, as well as just share some of his recommendations and advice as far as SPE techniques. The MultiPrep 7000 is CPI's second generation of extraction manifold. We've learned a lot over the past several years by surveying many of the laboratories using our earlier version of manifold, by also speaking with laboratories using alternate manifolds and competitors' manifolds, as well as doing internal testing. And we've come up with what we feel is the best and most versatile manifold on the market today. One goal that CPI had in mind while designing and producing this manifold was to come up with a product that would be very flexible in your laboratory. We were able to achieve this by producing a manifold that gives you very many options as far as the number of stations you choose to use, as far as the size of sample reservoirs you choose to use, the size of the extraction stations themselves, and also the type and size of collection vessels. This manifold here is currently set up with six stations. However, you can order just a rack in one position and then build up to six as needed. If you need more than six, you can start off with two manifolds, even three manifolds. Link them together and have six, 12, 18 positions. Again, we wanted you to have a lot of options as far as getting the setup which is most appropriate for you. CPI wanted to give you the option of selecting the size of sample reservoirs you choose per position. This manifold has some liter size sample reservoirs and some 300 milliliter size. You can easily switch between the two and choose whichever one is most appropriate for your application. We also give you the option of selecting the size of each extraction station. This manifold has 90 millimeter setup as well as 47 millimeter stations. It's also very easy to convert from the 47 millimeter to the 90, and I'll show you that in great detail in just a little bit. But this once again gives you flexibility. You don't have to dedicate a position to 90s only. You can work with the two, switch back and forth between the two. Makes it very compatible with several different extraction techniques, several different EPA methods. Each extraction station is capable of receiving a standard threaded VOA vial. This gives you the flexibility of using any size of standard VOA vial as a collection vessel, or you can screw in a glass joint and use any sort of boiling flask or concentrator tube which might be appropriate for your method. The reason that CPI has designed this manifold to offer so many different options is simply so that you can get one manifold that will not only perform all solid phase extraction techniques you may currently be performing in the lab, but one that will also be versatile enough to adapt to any solid phase extraction techniques which may be called on in the future. I'd now like us to take a closer look at how easily you can switch the sample reservoirs, how quickly and easily you can convert a 47 millimeter position to a 90 millimeter position, and also to take a closer look at the different options you have as far as collection vessels. In order to change your glassware, the reservoir retaining ring need only be loosened a couple of turns. The glass can then be slid out and replaced with a more appropriate size. Again, turning the reservoir retaining ring a few turns will ensure constant pressure and an optimum seal of the disc within the manifold. Notice that this was just a one-handed procedure and also that there was no loose parts such as clamps and other mechanisms which could be lost or clutter up the workbench. In order to convert from a 47 millimeter to a 90 millimeter extraction station, simply loosen the retaining ring, remove the glass, at this point, you'll also need to remove your stainless steel support screen and then completely remove the retaining ring from the 47 millimeter position. At this point, the complete 90 millimeter extraction station can simply be screwed onto the 47 millimeter station and is now fully operational. I have previously mentioned that any standard VOA vial can screw right into the base of the extraction station. Whether you want to use the 100 mil VOA vial, a 40 mil VOA vial, these are both very standard items and completely compatible with the manifold. In addition, we have glass joints of either 2425, 2440, or 1922. 
that also can be fitted into the bottom of the manifold. And this gives you the flexibility of using any sort of boiling flask or collection vessel which you are accustomed to using in your lab and which is most appropriate to your technique. CPI produced the Multiprep 7000 to be a very compact unit so that it won't take up much space underneath your fume hood. Its dimensions are 19 and a half inches long, 10 inches wide, and depending on your sample reservoirs, up to 19 inches tall. Besides being very efficient and compact in size, the manifold is extremely sturdy. Its specially designed base evenly distributes weight to prevent tip over. Even with three full liters of water in the front three positions, it won't be prone to tipping in any way. This manifold is also extremely durable and very inert. Your sample will only come in contact with either 316 stainless steel or Teflon. This will prevent any contamination or carryover, and it will also prevent the manifold from being attacked and degraded by your sample matrix. CPI has incorporated standard formats for the glassware of the sample reservoir and the collection vessels. We've done this so that you're actually using glass that you probably already have around the laboratory. It's very easily accessible. This will prevent you from having to go out and paying very high prices for customized glassware to replace consumable supplies. I'd now like to focus on what makes the Multiprep 7000 so unique and so user friendly, and that is its three-way valve. Each station has its own integrated stainless steel and Teflon three-way valve. Each station also supports its own disc, its sample reservoir, and its own collection vessel. This three-way valve allows the analyst to independently control each station of the manifold. By leaving the valve in the off position, you are maintaining the vacuum within the system. You can use sensitive vacuum control to go to the wash. This would be done during conditioning of the disc and also filtering of the sample. And you would observe your sample being pulled down this clear tube and out to your collection vessel. Again, this is sensitive vacuum control because the more open, the more vacuum will go to this particular position. They are independent of each other so that you could have no disc activity in these four positions have this position wide open and this position barely open. And of course, the vacuum would be maintained throughout and different levels of vacuum would go to each independent position. The same three-way valve can then be used to channel your eluent down into your collection vessel. The Multiprep 7000 is the only manifold on the market that combines sensitive vacuum control and routing of the extracted sample and eluent into a single valve operation. This valve is designed to prevent carryover. It can be cleaned with minimal solvent wash and without the need for disassembly. Prices of manifolds will vary depending on how you want your particular manifold configured. The manifold you see here is priced well under $3,000. The manifolds always come pre-assembled and are backed by a full one-year warranty. The Multiprep 7000 truly offers flexibility, durability, at an economical price.